you going? Good. How are you? Good to see you. Hi, Brian. Well, thank you for coming. I know it's a bit of a mystery. I just want to show you a new range of Veravoo products that we're bringing out. We're going to cook one of them today. 30 minute milk meal base, rich and rustic, simple, Generally easy. 30 yes, yeah. yeah, and you'll see, we'll cook it today. All right. Because I know I'm skeptical with that sort of yeah. thing too. You can set your timers if you like yeah. if you're skeptical. Oh, Do you want to chop yeah. up that? Yeah, yeah chop up. We've just got sure. a nice, I buy the, just the mild trees over. If you want spicy, just buy spicy. Yeah. So I'm going to turn this um, little cooktop on. The good thing is too, one pan. So do you want to just chuck a couple of glug, a couple of tablespoons in there? Perfect. Yep, perfect. All right, so if you want to chuck in the onions. Now, onions really hurt my eyes. I'm so pathetic. So if you can do that, that would be great. Chicken. Pop, pop it all in. A little bit different, a little bit more interesting than your sort of standard taco number. So it's all just beautiful spices and vegetables. No numbers, no E numbers, nothing like that, all natural. Okay, so what we need is 500 mils of chicken salt. It's good having helpers. I'm not gonna put all the stock in yet, put most of it in. Yeah. And then we're gonna use a little bit to rinse out the jar. Sam, do you mind grabbing the rice? Now, you can use paella rice, that's fantastic, but I don't have any in my, I don't keep it in my pantry, so I'm just using Arborio. That's 200 grams, that goes in. Beautiful, and then I'm going to put the contents of the jar in. So you put the whole jar in, and I'm using my special Berenberg spoon. Um, because it's bottom. nice, it's long, and it's narrow, so it fits through the top of the jar nicely. Pour some stock in there, and then I'm just gonna do this. Okay, so it's that easy. Pop the lid on, and now 20 minutes. Let's go have a wine. <laughs> So let's check it out. Okay, oh my gosh, that's beautiful. Stir it a couple good. of times. It does look good, doesn't it? For the sort of remaining five minutes of the cook, we're just going to pop in a couple of peas, frozen peas. So how easy is that? So we'll just leave that for five minutes until the peas are cooked through, and, and then we'll be ready to serve. So how, how did it go to my wives? Oh, just made it. <laughs> so that looks really good. The peas are yeah, just cooked nice. through now. What I do is I'm just going to squeeze some lemon. These are from Banala, these lemons. Oh, <laughs> from my father-in-law's oh, lemon nice, tree. Papa. Yeah, thanks, Papa. So, I'm going to give you a try. Okay. Get a nice... You're allowed to have more? Oh, help yourself to a bigger serve there, Sam. <laughs> hey, well, I'm, just, I'm doing this to, for presentation work. purposes. Sure. So, there we go. Beautiful chicken chorizo paella. If you want to sort of have a bit of garnish, bit just of grab some, some parsley on top. Mm, you can chop it up. amazing. Yeah, you like it? It's really tasty. So there we are, chicken chorizo paella. Easy, simple and so delicious 30 minute meal from our family farm to your family table.